everybody, thanks for tuning in. Trevor here with Hanging Eye Hammocks. Uh, today I'm gonna show you how to tie a Marlin spike hitch, um, which goes really well with whippy slings, which makes the adjustment of your hammock height much easier. Um, to begin a Marlin spike hitch, uh, you'll either have to have some uh, carbon, um, which is about a couple inches long. Some people make them from arrows, um, piece of metal, uh, or you can just kind of scavenge around like I do, find two uh, pieces of stick, uh, that are about a half an inch to an inch in diameter. Uh, to tie a Marlin spike hitch, first, what you do is you take the bottom part of your tree strap, go up, so you create a loop right here, and then what you do is take your two fingers here, pinch, you'll take two fingers from back behind, come up, pinch the top of your tree strap, and pull it through. So what's gonna look like is this, go up, pull it through and you'll create a loop here. After you create that loop, you'll take your toggle, stick it through the loop and tension. Once you have this done, um, you'll get your whoopee sling, attach it over the knot, not the toggle. Again, you'll attach your whoopee sling here over the knot, not the toggle. What the toggle is for is to, um, when you're undoing it after you sleep on it all night, the toggle makes releasing this knot much easier um, from all the strain that you've put on it by sleeping in it all night. Um, so if you did put your whoopee sling over here and got in the hammock, it would break and you would end up on the ground. So again, real quick, make a loop, go up, pull the top through, stick your toggle through. And there you have it, over the knot not the toggle.